how to create a PDF book cover for Amazon KDP. So go ahead and open your browser. In the search bar, type in KDP book cover and then open this one, the calculator. In this site, you can then input the information of your book and this site will provide the dimensions that you need for your book cover for Amazon KDP. Take note that the size of the book cover depends on the number of pages of your book and this cover calculator will give you the perfect dimension that you need. So first, you have to select the binding type of your book. In here, you have the choice for it to be paperback or hardcover. We also have to provide the interior type. So we have here the black and white, the premium color, and the standard one. I will just choose the premium color in here. And below that is the paper type, which you can choose from cream paper and white paper. Moving on to the page direction, I'll just choose left to right since that's the pretty formal one. Now on the measurement unit, since this is a book that needs to be printed, I'll choose inches. And here I'll select 8.5 by 11 just to make sure that you're choosing the right dimension since this will affect the size of your cover. Lastly, input the pages or the number of pages that you have. This is important since this will determine the thickness of your book cover. Once you finished all of this information, click on Calculate Dimensions and this will then show. In here, we can see the dimensions that we need to follow for the full cover. So take this number when you're creating the book cover already. In my case, it needs to be 17.602 by 11.25 inches. This is a helpful platform because even the safe area, the bleed, the dimensions of the margin is provided. And aside from that, they also provide a template that you can use as a guide in creating your book cover. So this is the template. And to be able to use it, simply click on this download template button. And once it's downloaded, we have to unzip it and extract its content. So right click on the file, the file that we downloaded, and just extract it to wherever location you want. Just make sure that you can access the PDF and PNG file that will come out of it. Once you have the files, you can now proceed to the editing phase of the book cover. To do that, you can use any editing softwares. You can use Adobe Photoshop, Photopea, Canva, or any editing platform where you can create and edit graphics. In this video, I'll be using Canva since this is the most accessible and the easiest platform to use. So just open Canva on your browser or whatever platform you're using. Once you are in this page, just click on the create design button and in here select customize size this is where you will paste in the numbers from the book cover calculator so go back to that tab copy the width in here go back to canva and then paste that make sure that this is changed to inches after that copy the dimensions of the height as well once you input that, just create your design and you will then be directed to the editing page. Once you're in here, the first thing that you have to do is to upload the cover template so that we can use it as a guide. To do that, go to the upload tab. Here, it can be seen on the left panel. Click on upload files and then choose the PNG file of the cover template. Once that's loaded, simply tap on it and it will then be open on your canvas. Now just adjust its corner to fit the screen. This will be again the cover or the guide of our cover design. So make sure to lock this layer so that it will not move. When you're making the design of your cover, make sure that every element, every graphic, every text, every photo that you want to be presented is within these broken lines. In that way, the elements of your cover will not be cut or cropped once it's printed. So this right side is the front part of the book and then this is the back part. In here is the barcode section and what you want to do in here is to leave this blank and do not put any words or picture in it 
since the barcode that you will get from Amazon KDP before uploading this will be printed on this part. Now this middle part is the spin area of the book and the thickness of this one depends on the number of pages your book has. So the more pages, the thicker this will be. Now you can use the tools in here to design your cover. You can use the shapes in the elements to create the background or any shape. You can also use the search icon for the graphics that you want. So let's say you want an element, simply type that in and the results will then show. For example, you want a uh, vintage stickers. Enter that in and you can then use everything available in here. It may be graphics, photos, or videos. Just make sure that you will use elements without the crown icon unless you're subscribed to any of their Canva plan. The next thing that you can use in here is the text tab. Using this, you can type in the title, the book information, and any text that you want to be in your book. You can either use your fonts or you can use these combinations by Canva. So let's just type in my title and once you're done with your layout, flatten all the layers, save the file as PDF print on a CMYK color profile if you can. But since it is only available for Canva Pro, the RGB will do. And then the last thing to do is of course upload it on KDP Amazon. To do that, go to KDP website, click on create, and then choose paperback or whatever your book is. Input its title. Make sure that it has adjectives and helpful keywords so that your book will show once consumers look for coloring. Once consumers search for anything that they want. Proceed to the subtitle, the author, description. Make sure to also own your work, add in keywords that will make your book easier to search, select the category, and once you're done here, click on save and continue. In this page is the printing details. So first thing to do is to get free ISBN, input a publication date, choose printing options. So we just need black and white. So make sure that this is the same on what you input in the calculator a while ago. Choose the size. Again, mine is 8.5 by 11. No bleed. And then choose cover finish. So I want it glossy, but you can also choose the matte. And now you can upload your book content and the KDP cover. This may take a while uploading, but once it's done loading, you can preview it and then Tap on Approve once you're satisfied with the placement of your cover and pages. After that, click on Save and Continue. And in this page, you just need to set the price. And then after that, you can publish it. It will take 2 to 5 business days, but you will then be notified once your book is published. So that is how to create a PDF book cover for Amazon KDP. Do let us know if this video helped you out. And if you have any questions, feel free to drop them down below. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.